Welcome viewers to the tutorial of Video Scribe. In this video, I will teach you some basics, but effective ways, so that you can make your own videos as soon as possible. So, without wasting any time, let's begin. So, this is the screen on which you have to work on your projects. Here are some tabs, using this you can save this project, add image, add text, and everything you need to make a video. Now, if you want to add a text in here, just click this icon. Add text to the canvas. Click this. You will see this window. Here you can write anything you want. I am writing. Text 1. If you want to change font of this text, click this. Here you can find all the fonts available here. The problem is, all these fonts are not preloaded here. You have to select any of these fonts to load first. So, click any font you required. It will add it in your scribe. Now this font, you can see in here. Then click, OK. If you want to change the color, then again, double click on this text. And click here. Select any color you want, and click save. You can select your required color at the time when you're inserting your text. Let me show you. Click. Add text. Here. You can select any color for your text. No. Now, if you want to make this text bigger, or smaller. Here, you can drag this text edges, to make it big, or small. If you want to place this text, in any place of your canvas, then just drag this text to anywhere you're near. Now. How to add image, in canvas. You can see, this tabs here. Add an image, to the canvas. Click it, first. If you want to add image from your computer, then click this icon here. Then, click the image you want to insert. It will show you this window. Here, you can add this image, in so many different ways. But, I will show the image, in the original format. So, I clicked this one. It is loaded in your canvas. If you want to add image from video scribe image library, then go to add image. Here is the image library of video scribe. Click to see the library. Here. Here you can see lot of images in this library. Choose your required image. This is also placed in your canvas. Now, let's order their timings. Here you can see, which one came first, and which one last. If you want to reorder anything, do it like. If you want to change how this text one, appear on your video, then click this icon. If you want this text will draw in your video within 5 seconds, then change this. Let's see how many seconds will it take to draw. Click the play button here. Now, this text 2 will come after text 1, in some after 3 seconds. Then click this icon here. If increase this pause time here. If I set this pause time after 5 seconds. Then text 2, will appear after 5 seconds from text 1. Let's see, how. Click on this play button to see. Now. Now, if you want to see this screen as you see now, no zooming. Then, first click the text. Then, set your camera. Then, click this icon here. Now, let's see how this appear on our video. Click, play. C. 
see. This is how it works. If you want to remove anything, then just click that item. Click delete button on your keyboard. Click OK. Now, if you want to add music in your video, then click this music tab. Here you can see, lots of preloaded music here. Select your required. Or, you can select your favorite music from your computer, by clicking this icon here. Set your volume. Click OK. If you want to add voice directly, using your microphone, then click this. Click on record. Here you can see your video playing. Add your voice, and after completed, click on save. Now. Now. If you want to change background of your video, then select this tab. Here you can set your required background color, you wish. After then, click on save. Here are the background of video, will show like this. The problem is, you cannot choose any background image, from your computer. But I think, that would be necessary. Okay. We have done with our project, let's save it. Click this tab, here. Publish, or render your scribe video here. Click this icon. Select your required formats. Give any name you want. Then click on, Publish. It will take some time to render. After render complete, this video will automatically play to show. If you want to add or delete anything, or you want to modify your video, then this project will be already saved in Video Scribe Library, you can access when you reopen this Video Scribe. That's it guys. If you have any doubt regarding anything on using this software, comment in the comment section below. Thanks for watching this video, subscribe this channel, for more video like this. Goodbye.